The dashboard is the starting place that you're going to see each time you start up 6-Bit. It contains important information about your business and helps you keep an overall idea of what's going on. Some of the things it includes are 6-Bit announcements. If there's ever anything important that we feel all of our users should see, we'll put an announcement out that it'll appear here. It also contains a dashboard summary for any sites you might list on. Uh, if you have more than one seller account, you can choose the information for the seller account that you want to view. Another thing that is included on the dashboard is the to-do list. This can include different things depending upon um, what data you have in your database. Uh, things like items awaiting upload or orders paid and ready to ship. If you click the link, it'll take you directly to 6-Bit to the place where you um, can take care of the orders ready to ship. It also includes information about the latest version or the latest beta. If you're outdated, you can simply click the button here to go and get the latest version. Another thing it includes are some common tasks, things that you might do right off the bat. You might want to add a new item or review your running listings, view the user's guide. Clicking review running listings takes you right to your running listings. And then finally, down here near the bottom of the page is where it's going to show you the database you're connected to. 6-Bit stores its data in a SQL Server database, and you can switch databases. The message on the bottom tells you which database you're connected to and which server it's on. 6-Bit also allows you to create multiple user sign-ons for 6-Bit, so you can see who you're logged in as on the, on the dashboard as well.